didn't have Mr. Santa Claus, or uh, maybe it don't work that way. <laughs> oh, well, no, anyway, needless to say, I mean, you've been so good. Thank you, Santa. Santa has many, many wonderful things for you this year. Ho, ho, ho. Hello. <laughs> 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 uh, third, third, please, none of that. <laughs> Uh, I wonder who is next on my lovely list here of lovely boys and girls. Oh, yes, Rana. Oh, wonderful little Rana. Why, it seems like only yesterday, Rana, you were sleeping in your little bed with visions of Lennox and Royal Dalton. <laughs> yes, that was like yesterday. Fortunately, Rana, that you found a nice little friend of yours. And together you zip down the prime outlet <laughs> to find more of that wonderful, uh, that uh, wonderful stuff that dreams are made of. And fortunately, Ron, of course, uh, you have a wonderful man at home to bring all your dreams home to. And he enjoys them and loves you for all that. So really, Rana, this year, you already have two of the great gifts that Christmas have. Yes. And that is the gift of love and the gift of a friend. So we want to say to you, Merry Christmas, Rana, and many more, and you'll have many wonderful things this year also. Thank you, Santa. You're welcome. <laughs> Such a wonderful, I can remember her as a little, what a wonderful little girl. Let's see, who is next on my list? Oh, the good boy, Christopher. There he is. Oh, yes. And how good is Christopher? Let me tell you how good he is. He is so good that his co-workers want to duplicate him. They want another Christopher. And what boggles my mind is with all those copy machines sitting around there, what took him so long to make another one like you? Oh, well, nevertheless, Christopher, because you've been such a good boy, I'd like you to stand up and come over here, please. I want it to be that Everybody will know what a good boy you are, how good you are to your mother, how good you are to your co-workers, and how good you are for the company. And so I would like you to wear this around, Christopher, so that everybody will know henceforth what a wonderful person that you really are. <laughs> wear it in pride, in honor, what does it say? in majesty. wonderful people here tonight. <sighs> Jeff and Josie. Merry Christmas, Jeff and Josie. Merry Christmas to you. Are they here? Yeah, they're here. Jeff! Jeff and Josie. Could you, Jeff and Josie, please? I'm reading, I'm reading from my, I'm reading from my black book, Jeff and Josie. And this is what my elves have, little elves have written about you. Let me see. Uh, Make it short. <laughs> <laughs> short sweet, so. That's not possible. <laughs> that you, and Jeff, you and Josie is not possible. Anyway, now let's see. My, my. Oh, what do you know about them? Who would have thought? Cole. My goodness. <laughs> you know, children, everybody loves romance. I love romance. And there's a loving, wonderful couple named Jeff and Josie who love romance. I want you to picture this for me. Picture it's New Year's Eve. It's midnight. You're up in the woods of Dunellen. <laughs> You're laying on an air mattress in an open bed pickup truck looking up at the stars. Now isn't that romantic? That is so, imagine New Year's Eve, midnight, on an air mattress looking up at the stars. And I thought it was so romantic. That I wanted you to know, Jeffrey, you got me another that the next time you, <laughs> you do that, I'd like to have a little hot air pump <laughs> so that Josie don't have to blow up the mattress up in my ear. Up in the woods of Donnell. Very wonderful. Oh, let's see. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> that you become another
another J.P. Morgan in investment real estate. <laughs> and I'll tell you what, real estate's a very good thing to be in that it's day and age in Florida because yeah. what was $80,000 10 years ago goes up and up and now it's over 200000 so very good that you've done very well for yourself. And my yeah. else tell me you had a little accident this year and you were injured and, and uh, very sorry that that happened. I hope you recovered and you're enjoying life to the fullest and to the happiest. And we wish you many more Merry Christmases, Lynn. Thank Merry you, Christmas Santa. to Lynn. Jeff and Josie, oh, that was a wonderful story. Lynn, wow, wonderful. <laughs> Dave and Annabelle, Merry Christmas, or Dave and Annabelle. There's Annabelle and David. Merry Christmas to you. Another wonderful couple on Christmas Eve, I think, coming up. And my elf tell me that Dave plays the guitar and does a twist in the living room. <laughs> and Annabelle cooks and bakes in the kitchen. Yeah. Kind of a shake and bake couple, which is <laughs> Christmas to you, and the elves tell me that you're dutiful children to your parent and taking very good care of them, and I do want to thank you for all you do on behalf of your parents and everybody, and I uh, wish you all a merry, very merry Christmas, Dave and Annabelle, and many more to come, and Santa Claus has many, many presents for you this year. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.